Transportation is the largest source of greenhouse gas emissions caused by human activities in California. When we burn fossil fuels, such as gas, oil, and coal, we release greenhouse gases, especially carbon dioxide, into the atmosphere where they build up and trap heat that would otherwise escape. This heat-trapping blanket effect leads to the warming of the planet, and the atmospheric balance that keeps the climate stable is disrupted. Earth's climate is changing faster than at any point in the history of modern civilization. Global climate change has already resulted in a wide range of impacts across our country, state, and Bay Area region. Uh, some of the impacts I've experienced here in Santa Clara County is not being able to go outside and swim due to poor air quality. While I was trying to study for my midterm, the power went out at my house. Recognizing the environmental, social, and economic impacts of climate change, BTA's Board of Directors adopted a resolution declaring a climate emergency. This resolution committed VTA to prepare a climate action and adaptation plan to guide its response to the climate crisis. The CAP outlines strategies, measures, and actions that VTA will take to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. These actions include things like increasing transit travel speed and reliability through transit signal priority, dedicated bus lanes, and new or expanded rapid bus service. Increasing development around transit stations and along transit corridors. And providing affordable housing and access to the necessities of daily life available within a short walk, bicycle ride, or transit trip. The CAP also analyzes VTA's vulnerability to climate impacts, such as sea level rise, flooding, extreme heat, wildfire, and drought and proposes actions to adapt, build resilience, and minimize impacts to our riders, workers, and communities. These actions include bolstering emergency preparedness efforts, collaborating with member agencies and other partnering organizations to encourage and expedite shoreline protection and restoration projects, and integrating climate adaptation considerations into design standards, criteria, and long-term planning processes for transportation infrastructure and assets. Most importantly, the CAP sets VTA forward on a path towards climate action and away from the status quo and business as usual mindset for you, me, and future generations. Climate action is important to me because I like to surf and ride my bike. Climate action is important to me because my generation will bear the burden of this generation's inaction. The adoption of the climate action and adaptation plan is just the beginning. VTA will continue to engage community members to implement this plan and promote sustainability and climate resilience throughout the county and the region. We look forward to working with you to make Santa Clara County an even better place to live.